Well, Marcia, the state highway patrol says the driver of the tractor trailer involved was following too closely into the car in front of him. And here's how the interstate looked north of 73 after the chain reaction. In all, seven vehicles were involved. A trooper on scene tells 2 News four people were taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. One lane of traffic was blocked for hours, but all lanes are open now. The, the tractor trailer, if it's not keeping a shirt clear distance, it has a lot more weight to stop. Uh, it could have been a lot worse than it was. He did get stopped pretty well, but it did collide with the rear vehicle, which caused the chain reaction. Sergeant Gooding says the driver will be cited for not keeping enough distance between himself and the car in front of his semi. And the fine could be hefty, considering the crash happened in a construction zone. Reporting from the newsroom, Pam Elliott, 2 News on your side. All right.